the masked individuals first breaking into the store with the backhoe, then backing a white pickup truck to the entrance. Soon they can be seen pulling out a chain, which you can see. They then tried to connect to the damaged ATM. Abdullah says the chain was not long enough to connect to the ATM, so when the would-be thieves heard sirens, at least one jumped into the back of this pickup and drove off without even taking anything. I was born and raised in Oakland. I'm 51 years old. I've never seen nothing like this. I think the only way you can run a business in Oakland is you maybe have to, as soon as you close, you sleep in your store and stay locked and loaded with an AK-47 and just be ready because the police is not coming on time. This is not what we were promised, the American dream. You know, I don't see the American dream. I think it's American nightmare right now. It's tough to keep a low profile while driving around in a forklift, particularly in a place where there is guaranteed to be a lot of cameras, like this safe credit union on Wa Avenue north of I-80 in North Highlands. So they actually stole the uh, forklift from a nearby construction site, drove it uh, northbound Watt Avenue for a few miles with a work truck behind it, and nobody called it in, nobody questioned it. The ATM apparently fell out of the truck bed and into the middle of the road, causing a crash later that morning. Uh, white pickup truck.